Hi, I am Hardik Nayak from Engineering Guru 2020 YouTube channel. In this video, you will learn classification of cam and follower. This video will be very useful for understanding the concept of cam and follower and its application. First, what is cam and follower? A cam is a rotating machine element which gives reciprocating or oscillating motion to another element that is known as follower. Here you can see this is a cam and this is follower. The cams are usually rotated at uniform speed by a shaft but the follower motion is speed determined and will be according to the shape of the cam. Here we can see that cam is driver member and follower is driven member. Now application of cam and follower, the cams are widely used for operating the inlet and exhaust valve of internal combustion engine. Here you can see that this is follower and this is cam. Rotary motion convert into reciprocating motion and used for opening and closing for valve in IC engine. Cam and follower also used in fuel pump diesel engine, shoe making machine, saw machine, punching machine, paper cutting machine. Now classification of follower here first according to the surface in contact, second according to the motion of the follower and third according to the path of motion of the follower. So, according to the surface of contact is divided into four parts. First, knife face follower, second rolling follower, third flat face follower and final spherical face follower. Second type divided into two types. First, reciprocating follower, second oscillating follower and third type divided radial follower and offset follower. We are going to see detail of each type of follower one by one. First, according to the surface in contact RS follow. So first knife edge follower when contacting end of the follower has sharp knife edge. Here you can see this is the sharp knife edge. The sliding motion take place between the contact surface that is knife edge and the cam surface. In knife edge follower, a considerable side thrust exists between the follower and the guide. Second, rolling follower. In this figure, we can see that this is follower, this is radial follower and this is cam. When the contacting end of the follower is roller, it is called rolling follower. Since the rolling motion take place between the contacting surface that is rolling and the cam. Therefore, the rate of the wear is greatly reduced. The roller follower are extensively used where more space is allowable such as in stationary gas and oil engines and aircraft engines. Now, third is flat face follower. So, this is uh, flat face follower and this is cam. When the contacting end of the follower is perfectly flat face, it is called flat face follower. It may note that the side thrust between the follower and the guide is much reduced. In case of flat face follower, the flat face follower are generally used where space is limited such as in cam which operate the valve of automobile engines and final type that is spherical phase follower here we can we can see that this is the follower and this is cam here the follower shape is spherical when the contacting end of the follower is of spherical space it is called a spherical space follower it may note that when a flat phase follower is used in automobile engines, the high surface stresses are produced. In order to minimize the these stresses, the flat end of the follower is machined to a spherical face. Now, second type, according to the motion of the follower, are of the following two steps. First one is reciprocating or translating follower. When the follower 
reciprocates in guides as the cam rotate uniformly it is known as reciprocating or translating follower second oscillating or rotating follower when the follower when the uniform rotary motion of the cam is converted into predetermined oscillatory motion of the follower it is called oscillating or rotating follower third according to the path of the motion of the follower two types first radial follower when the motion of the follower is along an axis passing through the center of cam it is known as radial follower in this figure we can say that this is knife edge follower this is rolling follower flat face and spherical face follower part b that is offset follower when the motion of the follower is along an axis away from the axis of the cam center it is called offset follower here we can say that this is knife edge follower for offset this is for rolling follower flat face and spherical face classification of cam it divide in three types so first radial or disc cam in radial cam the follower reciprocates or oscillates in direction perpendicular to the cam axis second that is cylindrical cam the cylindrical cams the follower reciprocate or oscillate in the direction parallel to the cam axis the follower rides in groove at its cylindrical surface a cylindrical groove cam with a reciprocate and final type that is end cam in end cam a reciprocating portion of a cylinder the follower translate or oscillate whereas the cam usually rotates the end cam is rarely used because the cost and difficulty in cutting is counter at the end if you find my video helpful you can like comment share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you